Come on! <laughs> Good old taco trucks. Oh wow, you weren't lying. Also, the Google page is in Swedish, which is crazy cool. Yep. Crazy cool. But yeah, so taco trucks apparently wasn't lying to us. We can indeed kill this thing. It'd be nice if it meant that later on we didn't have to kill it again. That was pretty quick and successful. Yeah, it turns out you just have to hold your ground. Like, and keep firing at the eye of it, or the, the nozzle. Um, if you get out and run right at the very end, it actually just shoots you and kills you all. It like blows this entire area up. We're gonna grab this real quick and we're gonna take it along for the ride. Actually, I think we need it to. Oh no, not yet. Okay. Let's go. I'm gonna grab all the armor and stuff we can. Oh, there's his helmet. That's weird. And we're gonna keep this spinning as we go through. Um, <clears throat> Chat, you need to hold me accountable because we need to do this. We need to go through areas slowly for two reasons. One, we want to make sure we get all the loot. But also, if we go fast through them, um, on this difficulty, you almost always die. Uh, oops. Simply because the faster you move, the less chance you have to kill enemies or sneak up behind enemies. I don't know what we just did, but we did something. Hmm. Wait, is there a... There's a room behind this. Like, right... Wait, it's... it's Right there. Alright, we're gonna drop this real quick. Wait, that's not... Damn it. So maybe we can get in... So there's there's a hidden object here. I'm not really sure... Huh. Let's go look around this corner and see what's over there. There has to be some way to get get into that room. But it doesn't look like there's a way to get in there from this next area. And these don't seem to do anything, so... Oh! <laughs> Those fools! What did they think they were doing? His hat, I mean his his helmet just there it is. So we grab these helmets, they give us more armor, and that's that's why we're shooting them off. You just obliterated them, yeah. Because they just they just walk past us like we weren't even there. There it is. Hmm. Maybe we need to pull all these and then run to the next room. And some door over there opens up. Let's check. Should have killed most of the guys in here. Let's see, no, see, so we're past it. And it looks like there is an entrance in that area. It would be directly to the right, like right here. Or right here. If you guys see anything, let me know, because I would like to get in here. I'd like to find this. 
And it's on this level as well, which is... Or if you know anything from playing this game previously. So maybe there's an order to it? Let's try middle left and then right. No? Yeah, I played about 40,500 40, hours of this game. So def left right. Yeah, it doesn't look like that works. I'm guessing you're lying because 40,000 hours would be... An absolutely ridiculous amount. Oh, maybe this is Ein Dre Zwe. Maybe this is like a hint in German. I don't know what these words mean though, unfortunately. Ein Dre Zwe. Oh! I did something! Ah! Okay, so. It Th these must mean like one, three, two, or something like that in German. We found something, chat. Nice. Okay, an enigma piece. Very cool. See, and the silencer. Okay, we get the silencer early in here. One, three, two. Yeah, that's what I thought. My interpretation skills are next level right now. Do you speak German as well, or you just looked them up? Or just guessed like I did? All right, this will be good. That means that we can have a silencer to kill these next uh, next generals that we find. I googled it, and it says 132. Yeah. I guessed, and it says 132. <laughs> Booyah! This, um, when you have this thing idling, it, uh, sounds like there's crazy white noise going on. Oh, we just found a bug. If you pick something up while it's crazy, I while the thing is idling, the, the annoying white noise goes away. I will take that. We found a letter. Let's re let's actually read this letter. I don't think we read this one last time. To German name, dear Heinrich, I hope your letter I hope this letter finds you well. I'm sitting outside on the porch of the hospital where I'm recovering from my wounds. A good-looking nurse rolled me out here so I could write to you. A volunteer from Munich, she tells me. Here in Dar es Salaam, afternoon is drawing near. A chill breeze comes in from the sea, and with the breeze comes a smell of fish and rotting seaweed and the almost unbearable stench from the burning bodies by the shoreline. The view of the land from this location is absolutely gorgeous. I have found Africa to be, in many ways, a wondrous place. It has an air of freedom, a sense of adventure, if you will. I wish you, would have, I wish you could experience it with me, Heinrich. I have also seen things I wish I could have unseen. Remember how I told you once that I would never regret my decision to quit my education and join the army? To be honest, in the grimmest of moments, I have cursed my decision. Yeah, how morbid, with the burning bodies. I still pondered this, and if I hadn't left the university, would I not still have felt as lost and aimless as I did? Speaking of which, how was Elsa? Have you spoken to her at all? Have you seen her on campus, perhaps? On the, on the street or by the river where we used to fish? Maybe I, could not a maybe I should not ask this, but I do think of her when darkness falls over the desert. It's comforting. The violence can be tough to handle. Some of the men are losing it. They say... We shouldn't even be here, and I understand why they say this, especially the less experienced ones. They're afraid, to, you see, afraid of the guerrilla soldiers, the primitives. A month ago, we were out in the desert. I was piloting my wolf tank. We were four men in the tank, me, Hoswolf, Gunther, and Kellerman. Have you seen these tanks? They come straight out of General Strauss's wor workshop. They're fueled by nuclear, nuclear reactors and are armed with a state-of-the-art weaponry. A troop of wolf tanks can decimate an entire village in the, in the blink of an eye. However, the one thing these machines of war can't handle is abundant 
in the desert. Sand. <laughs> we didn't see it coming. Somewhere close to the Tonga Tongajikan border, a dust storm blew up out of nowhere. Within minutes, everything was covered in sand. It got into the engines and under the cracks of the hole and caused the tanks to malfunction. Suddenly, we found ourselves stranded. We had no choice but to set up camp. There were 20 of us in our squad. We took turns guarding the perimeter. I was woken by a blood-curdling scream in the middle of the night. I ran outside. The camp was in a statue of abs state of absolute chaos. My men were running like headless chickens while dark men, primitives, this is so messed up how they called them primitives, dressed in strips of leather, faces painted red, and whites of their eyes glowing in the darkness, leapt across the camp and gutted and slashed our men. I saw Gunther eviscerated where he stood. He tried to hold his guts in, but they slipped between his fingers. One of the primitives came at me and from no came at me from nowhere and stabbed me in the stomach. I managed to grab my gun and shoot him in the head. I pulled out the knife and crawled away from the scene and then ran across the desert. The terrible screams haunting me through the night. I was told they kept some of them alive to torture them while the dead were hung upside down, disemboweled, and their sexual organs cut off and shoved down their throats. Jesus, this is awful. <laughs> You'll understand that a lot of men here, they are beginning to lose their morale. And to a degree, that is understandable. I, however, will not surrender to these feelings of weakness. No matter how tempting they may be, I will stand by my belief and the ideals of our leader. We are stronger. We are the stronger race, and there can be no room for anyone but us. I hope you still feel the same way as I do. Your friend, the crazy racist Nancy, Oscar Weismuller. Yes, if you see El Elsa, tell her that I still love her. DS. Late reply, but I know that one, two, three, and four are in German and some other words. Swedish is a bit like German, not much, but a little. And my brother studied German for five years in school. Gotcha. That's pretty cool. Yeah, it's kind of like how I can I can count in Spanish. It's kind of Spanish counting and certain things like that are just general knowledge to most Engl English speakers or American English speakers. Uh, a tea feels really good on my throat, especially after reading like 20 paragraphs by that, whoever was writing that. Okay, onward. Oh, more bullets, but we don't need them. So there should be two more in here. Uh, two more um, secrets. However, there are going to be a bunch of people right around this corner, so we're going to be careful and shoot them. When I said be careful, I mean just open fire. No, <laughs> he blew up. Okay. Going to switch weapons. Shabam! Wow. Heck yeah. Okay. So I think I think these are our guys. But we're going to have to blow this off to get up the next cliff, so we're going to go ahead and do that. Who's shooting me? Oh. Ya fools, don't shoot the man with the cannon. Yeah, that should be all of them. We're full on assault rifle ammo. Let's go ahead and take these helmets if we can... Get into there. There we go. We're gonna take this uh, giant gun with us as well. Because there should be a couple more dudes up here that we didn't get with the. Make sure we're. Okay, so there is a secret in here as well. Maybe like right behind. I think we actually... Okay. What the hell? Where is it? Is it just underneath this? Oh, shit, it is! Okay, it's like right underneath there. It's just like a golden chalice. What a convenient place to hide that. <laughs> yeah, so th these are the sorts of things we missed on the last play playthrough that we're going to be... By and large, trying to find most of them on this go round. Should I say 100%? Gonna 100% this? Probably not, but we're gonna look for most of the things. It 
should be the last thing. Okay, there's one more thing in this area over here. Oh, I remember what happens here. I'm about to get the shit scared out of me if I didn't remember that. E! <laughs> this is such a random interaction. I'm glad they trained them to fetch grenades. But the interesting thing is, instead of going up there, we are supposed to come over here and find this Enigma piece before saying hi to w Private Wyatt. Grab all the armor we can. And there we go. Hey, buddy. Pay attention, beard boys. This is all Wait, why didn't you go with the guy who was helping you? Because we're trying to find all the collectibles. And we did go with the guy, as you just saw, who was helping us. But before we went with him, because it's triggering a cutscene right here. And we wouldn't have been able to go back and get that. So we wanted to get the collectible and then, then do this. No. General Death's head is nearer to us now than he's been in years. So must be Hadn't been there yet, lag. I don't know if it's lag, it's just... We cut the head off the crowd war machine. We don't. They're gonna have us for breakfast. You alright there, kid? I'm just... Ping delay. It should be anywhere from like 8 to 30 seconds depending on where you live. Yeah, no, I, I understand what you're saying. Yeah, that's what you ping delay. Exhale, count to four. So we ready then, lads. This time, we get the job done. Yeah, Fergus. I'm actually super excited to save Fergus. Cause last time we got it, we killed Fergus because that's probably what Fergus would have wanted. He he would have wanted to save Wyatt. This is a war, not fucking Sunday church walk. Come on. Father and son. But this time, Wyatt's going. That dude's eye looks painful. Captain Blaskowitz, Gates, Benson, your job is simple. Climb up this wall, get inside, locate the control room for this big fucking door and open it for us. You see any Nazi firearms, you take them. Might be better than ours. The rest of us will come here from down here. Now, once the doors open, we get inside, we work our way up through the building, we meet up again on the top floors, we find Death's head, and we shoot him in the head. Check, check. No pressure, lads. But keep in mind, this may be our last chance. If we don't get Death's head now, it is all over. No crime. Focus out. Let's get, try not to, um, get crushed by any falling uh, falling Nazis, Nancy's, piggies, Nazis. 